also been talking about a return to pre-pandemic life. Now it seems the U.S. is moving backward with the president even mentioning lockdowns and shutdowns once again. President Joe Biden says that more vaccinations and more mask wearing will prevent the U.S. from returning to those kind of closures. Here's Allison Harris with more details. The CDC is recommending people put on their masks indoors yet again, even if they're fully vaccinated in areas where there's low vaccination and high COVID spread. Those areas include areas shown in red, meaning much of the southeast and parts of the west. The CDC director saying that new scientific data shows even those who are fully vaccinated can carry and transmit the Delta variant called COVID on steroids. It's a major reversal for the Biden administration, which declared independence from COVID and a summer of freedom earlier this month. This was just two months ago. If you've been vaccinated, you don't have to wear your mask. I think it's a great milestone, a great day. When he made those comments back in May, uh, we were dealing with a very different strain of the virus. The president, in a statement mentioning lockdowns and shutdowns, saying more vaccinations and mask wearing in the areas most impacted by the Delta variant will enable us to avoid those closures, as 51 percent of the country is not fully vaccinated. But if you're not vaccinated, you're not nearly as smart as I thought you were. The CDC director saying this could have been avoided had more Americans gotten their shots. The CDC also recommending that students at all grade levels from kindergarten through high school wear masks going back to school, even if they're over 16 and have been vaccinated. The governor of Nebraska firing back on Twitter, telling the CDC to get out of the way, saying students won't be required to wear masks or get vaccinated. Several states have already banned mask mandates, including Florida, Arkansas, Iowa, Montana, South Carolina, Tennessee, and Texas. There's now outrage and debate over masks once again from a Tennessee pastor vowing to oust members of his congregation if they wear masks. If they go through round two and you start showing up all these masks and all this nonsense, I'll ask you to leave. I will ask you to leave. To a let them breathe rally in California. Masking requirements, they're arbitrary. That was Allison Harris reporting. Now, health experts maintain that severe breakthrough cases for those who are fully vaccinated still remain very rare, but they do happen. Meanwhile, the president says that more vaccine mandates for federal workers are now under consideration.